bowl prep gone for you? It's good. It's good. You know, get back into the groove of things. Had a good couple practices this week. Just how, I guess, you know, how satisfied have you been with the way you've grown the season and your consistency and what you've been able to contribute? Yeah, it's been really good. Um, haven't focused too much on results, just focused on the process and getting better. Um, so, yeah, it's been, it's been really good. You guys added a talented kicker in the, you know, signee. Um, what do you know about Jake and, um, you know, how excited to get him on campus and, you know, start working with him? Yeah, I've, I, you know, he's a really good kicker coming out of high school and we're excited to get him here and, and just happy that he chose Florida State and, you know, continue the legacy of, of kickers here. So. How have you guys been able to, to build that change your focus? I mean, obviously there's so much excitement about Yeah, it's our it's our next opportunity, and we got to make the most of that. Is it been challenging to get that Yeah, I mean, um, just you know, refocusing, you know, controlling what we can control. You know, you, got, you guys proved how good of a team you were the last 13 games. Now, as jarring, like you guys feel you have to come out and show the world something else in this game. It, it, do you guys have to do that? Or? Yeah, I think we just play our ball. You know, whenever we play our best, nobody can compete with us. So, you know, we're just focused on playing our best, going out there each play. Coach Norvell, when you going back for next year, I mean, is that a long thought process or kind of easy decision? Like, how do you go about making that decision? You know, um, you know, coming off a really good year this year, then, you know, still one more game to finish with that. and. You know, I want to want to have another good year like that next year, and then and then look up to, to the next level. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for for another year to to keep improving and getting better. The, the success you guys, all, that whole unit had, James got honors, Alex got you got honors. Did you? When did you realize you guys could have that kind of year together? Uh, we always knew that. You know, we we always knew that we had the potential through the roof. Um, it's just about going out and executing day to day and getting better. Um, so yeah, it's been really cool for for all three of us in the group to to get some recognition and have the years we've had. Um, so yeah, it's it's really exciting to to do that. And you know, James' last game coming up, and he's had a heck of a career. He's been a heck of a snapper, and so um, yeah, just just uh, it's been really pleasing the way the way we performed this year. You, I know you guys have guys in the program that are coming up. Um, you already, when do you start working with those guys? Will it be in the spring or do you start doing January. Really? Yeah. Uh, when it comes to like, you know, someone like Tyler who transferred in and kind of gave you competition beginning of the year, how much did he help you to become where you are right now? Yeah, you know, um, it was a really good competition and, and just pushing each other to, to be our best every day. You know, our focus was on ourselves and, and focus on ourselves getting better. But at the same time, it's competition, you know, so it's going to bring out the best of us. And, and it was really good. I know you grew up closer to Tallahassee than Athens, but was there, was there ever a Georgia phase in your life? Anybody in the family Georgia fans? A little bit. A little bit, <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, a little, little fun wrinkle to this game for you to go up against, the, I guess, you know, the in-state school and some maybe family members that pulled for the dogs. But yeah, no, it's 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 really special um, to have this opportunity and and kick, you know, play against them. And, um, yeah, I'm really excited. My, my family's really excited. and They bleed guard and gold now, so... <laughs> They'll be on the right side of things. When you have, like, you know, going to a bowl game that you have experience playing in, does that help a little bit versus, like, an unknown stadium? Yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah. Miami's a really, really nice stadium, and it's obviously warm down there this time of year, so the ball is traveling further. And Yeah, yeah. No, it, it does help kind of getting a sense of, of how the stadium is, the the grass and wind conditions, all that stuff. I'm going to ask more things about James. Is it uh... – just is it the accuracy or speed how quickly it gets back I mean, what makes it good it's, it's all of it it's all of it the placement of it the the speed of it you know having the laces out on field goal which he's done a really good job with you know um and then the speed the timing of it it's more time for me to see the ball down you know it's, it's still you know i get more time to see the ball and see the speed spot um so yeah all of that goes into to the season he's had you know a really good season a lot of times we focus fans and media I think of the holder with getting the laces out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's uh, he takes great pride in that. Um, and when the lace is already out, you know, Alex just puts the ball down, and, and you know, it's sitting on a tee, ready to be kicked, pretty much. Um, but yeah, he's he's really good at that, and and yeah. Y'all good.